Hey, welcome to the show. Today on the show, I'm going to go over division. I'm going to be dividing this four-digit number by a one-digit number, but I'm going to take it kind of slow and easy, cheesy, lemon squeezy. We're going to take time to explain the process. All right, let's get started. First of all, you can see up here I have the words divide, multiply, subtract, and bring down. That's the process of dividing a big number like that. Now, if you have trouble memorizing this, you could always use the letters D, M, S, and B. And if you, this would be divide, multiply, subtract, and bring it down. All right. And to memorize these letters, you could always think of like daddy, mommy, sister, brother. All right. So it's kind of a little bit of a trick here. All right. Let's begin here. First of all, when we divide a bigger number like that, we just got to take it nice and slow. And we take a look at this right here. Can I put five into five? Yes, we can. So I'm going to go ahead and put the one right here. And one times five. Now I'm doing the second step right here. Multiply. One times five is five. All right. And I put the subtraction sign here. Just like that. And now I go to the next step. I bring it down. All right, I bring it down. So I'm going to bring this number all the way down. All the way down to here. Okay. Now, can I put 5 into 2? I'm starting it all over again. Can I put 5 into 2? You can't. So if we can't do that, we put a 0. I'm going to put a 0 right here. All right. And we go all the way over here to bring the next number down. Just drop it down. I like to put a little squiggly line. You don't have to do that, but sometimes it kind of helps out. I'm going to bring that squiggly line all the way down here and put a number three. Okay. Now here's another trick when you are dividing numbers. Sometimes if you don't know your multiplication number, you know, uh, facts, very well. Sometimes I'll write out some multiplication facts. So I'll do 5 times 2 equals 10. 5 times 3 equals 15. 5 times 4 equals 20. And 5 times 5 equals 25. I can keep on going, but this is kind of a nice reference right here to kind of fall back on. And so what number is close to 23 but doesn't go over? Well, right here, 5 times 4 equals 20, all right? So I am dividing right now. I'm going to put this 4 right here. 4 times 5, I'm multiplying. 4 times 5 equals 20. So put the 20 right here. Next step, subtract, all right? You guys are math ninjas. And then bring the next number down. So I'm going to bring this number right down after I subtract. I forgot to put the answer there. And I'm bringing the next number down all the way down here. And this would be 5. 35. Start the whole thing over. Again, how many times can I put 5 into 35? I'm going to do a few more facts over here. 5 times 6 equals 30. 5 times 7 equals 35. Bingo! We hit it right at the, hit the nail on the head. So it would be 7, all right? So I'm going to put a 7 right here. 7 times 5 equals 35. I'm putting the 35 right here. Subtract. And we have a remainder of 0, all right? So this is our answer right here. 5,235 divided by 5 equals 1,047. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show. Make sure you check out my other videos. I have a lot of other videos uh, dealing with division. Division is so much fun. It's like a puzzle. Um, I really like uh, working with big numbers. Um, so I hope you do too. Um, leave a comment down below. Uh, maybe if you've got a question on this process or another problem, or just tell me about your day. So I hope you have a great day out there and we'll talk to you later. Adios. Bye-bye.